cuties thank you for tuning back to my channel in this video i'll be showing you guys how i created this crochet weave it's a crochet weave guys it is it was actually inspired by another youtuber her name is pig mail she make awesome videos on how to make wig how to make weaves and beauty videos generally she's really really awesome i'll be leaving a link to her video in the description bar below do check her out so i saw a video where she made a hair that is similar like this one but she actually used peruvian human hair she used four packs of human hair and one closure to create a look like this one i thought as she recreate this hairstyle using expression braiding hair yes i use expression braiding hair to create this hair i used two packs of expression hair i did cut it into three and then pull the ends to make sure the end is not um, looking blunt so i did also straighten it out to get it to look this as sleek as possible guys I'm really loving this hair guys. I am really really loving the hair. Actually, I want to show you how to do the knotless method because I already have a video on how to do the regular crochet. So I did see the need to um, prolong this video by showing you how I did the regular crochet method. So I'll be leaving the video to that other video in the description bar. Do check the video out if you if you want to um, learn how to do the regular crochet method but for this video I will only show you the knotless method so that the link this video is not gonna be so that this video is not gonna be super long without further ado let's jump into it guys right guys here is my braid pattern I have a total of 14 braids in front and 7 braids at the back. You don't have to um, worry about making your braids to be very neat. The hair will be covered anyway. So I will go ahead and install my back side and then I will come back and show you guys how I am installing the hair. I'll see you in a bit. Bye. This is how the regular crochet method looks like this. You can see the knots while the knotless method will give you a look like this. So I will show you how I achieve this. Look. take out a piece of hair you don't need it too tiny or too big just medium size so that it can be able to cover the knots like so all you need to do is to slide your crochet needle into the hair very close to each other you don't need to leave gap slide in the hair to the to the hook close the lash hook pull the hair through like so and then remove the needle you have your loop like this the normal crochet braid or wave is where you take the whole hair and loop it through the the loop but in this case you only need to take one strand of the hair and the one you have to take is the one that is out to this side not the one that is in it's very very important because if you don't do it that way the knots will still be showing so you check which of the strands is is the outer one that is the one you'll be looping through and then leave the other one 
so what you need to do is separate the hair get the one that is out and twist the loop like so loop through the hair twist it again loop through the hair twist it again and loop through the hair I've been knotting it three times and then get the other strand of hair and pull to make sure the hair is secured like so I will show you another one take out a piece of hair medium size not too big and not too small as much as it, it can cover the knot loop the hair through as close as possible to the next one Slide the hair into the crochet hook, close the lash like so, pull the hair through to the other end, take out the needle, you have your loop like this, separate the hair, take the outer part of the hair and leave the one that is in like this. This is the outer one as you can see. Twist, twist the loop and loop the hair through. Twist, loop the hair through. Twist, loop the hair through. You can knot it more than three times. I feel it's very secured with three knots. Pull the hair and there you have Slide in the hair, close the lash hook, pull the hair through like so. Remove the, the needle, you have a loop like this. Twists and loops.